Should Bobby Bacala have been promoted earlier? Welcome back to Fog Entertainment. It is The Sopranos Season 4 and a big fat man. Tony probably didn't want another fat man joining the organisation in case they were going to eat his food. It's Gabagool. I don't know, there's quite a lot of fat men in the organisations. Ah, well, Fito's pretty big, but here. Don't want too many. But we're simply asking, should he have been promoted earlier? Of course it was season four, episode one, he got promoted. We didn't see him till the start of season two. Big Bobby. He's kind of just driving Junior around, right? And I was actually quite impressed by this poll. There's 13 comments, and I was like, what? Holy crap, I didn't even know the guy's second name. Bobby back Yeah, yeah there's 13 comments. Ah, well, the reality is it was two guys replying to each other slabbering. So, All right. Well. right. There is, we'll read a few other comments, but for the most part we won't, but let's just talk about it. 163 votes, 66% voting yes, 34% voting no. I think he should have been promoted earlier. I agree. I think Bobby's always been loyal to Junior, plus he's a likeable character, he's dependent. Now, do they look at him and think that, you know, he's fat, he's a joke, he's uh, not competent or whatnot? I mean, maybe, maybe they don't know if they can trust him, and I don't mean trust as in like uh, touting or being a snitch or anything like that. I just mean maybe they don't realize, don't understand, if don't think he's up for the, the job. Ah, uh, the job. But I mean, if you look at Pine Barrens. <laughs> sorry for botch. Uh... So if you look at Pine Barrens, right, he actually went out with Tony during the middle of the night and rescued Christopher and Polly. He stepped up to the task quite a lot and he's looked after Junior pretty much since the start of season two. Yeah, and that wasn't even his crew. Aye, so he's he like, goes to show he's committed. He's committed to the life, damn it. So what are you going to go for? Well, I don't think Ralph would have been out searching for them. <sighs> no, I don't think he would have been. Tony did laugh at him in a pretty funny scene where he came in dressed in all orange. But yeah, you know what, right? I think he should have been promoted earlier. But as the comments say, I kind of agree with this. Freebie says no. He was a total man-child. Only in later seasons he became a, perf- a solid performer. I mean... You know what? I, I I can't deny he's a total man child. He comes off with some shite. Well, you know what? I think Polly's also a total man child. I think Sylvia's a man child. I think Chris is a bit of a man child. I think they're all fucking man. I think Tony's the biggest man child <laughs> of them fucking all. Yeah. So I mean, while I can definitely see while people that people think that Bobby is a man child, I think you could say the same about the majority of them. Yeah, absolutely. He did get a response here for uh, Savage Turtle. Oh wait, oh, and he said. Care to explain your reasoning? Because I don't remember it that way. And this is what he's saying here. He says, He was goofy in the first seasons. Kind of a comical character who was really dumb with his quasi moto theories. Which he did reference, by the way, in the episode we just watched. I thought it was funny when he said it, and Tony kind of shot him down, but anyway. And then he says, And duck hunting costumes and train sets, etc. The way he talked was so soft and childish, and he almost never used profanity, etc., etc. But then later on, becomes somehow more serious, especially after he kills his first guy. Right, yeah. Right, he had the duck hunting costume, but so what if the guy dressed up? He, he, he dressed up and fucking rescued two guys. Did, they, right. did, did Polly and Chris care what he was wearing when he saved the day? I mean, what's worse, him dressing up or Ralph taking up the ass? Yeah, I know it's worse, right? And he says he has train sets. So what if the guy wants to play with fucking tra- model trains? Tony wants to go to his back garden and play with ducks. Aye. Christopher injects heroin into his toes. I think I think we're being too harsh on Big Bobby here. Yeah, I mean, when this he's going to say, yeah, he cried about his wife when he died. Uh, Savage Turtle responded, he says, I get he was more a comical character, but it didn't make him a man-child. He was still very mature and took care of business when he needed to, and the way he speaks is because he is very polite compared to the rest and takes manners seriously. Plus, it's not his fault he was stuck taking care of Junior most of the series, and he even asked Tony to be more involved at some point in the middle of the series, but I understand where you're coming from. Right, I could read out the rest of the comments, but it's more of a tip for tat sort of thing where they just bounce off each other, these two guys. But the point is, one thinks he's a man-child, the other thinks he ain't. Here, I think he is a very polite member. The rest of them are very vulgar. And the fact that he cared for his wife and he actually has kids and he cares about them and doesn't sleep around with other women and, you know, kill people on the, the regular. I really like Bobby. I've, I always said it, that this guy is one of the genuine nice guys in this crew. There's not a lot of people you can root for in The Sopranos, but for me, Bobby Bacala Jr. is one of them. I'm rooting for him. I think he should have been promoted earlier. I'm glad that he's a made man. Yep, and he is a made man. He's been promoted. Will he get further promotions throughout this series? We'll have to wait and see. But uh, yeah, his wife's... Well, how much further can he be promoted? Well, I guess he can... He's not a captain, so there you go. Is he not? No, he's not a captain, no. I don't believe he's a captain. Fuck, he seems to be Junior's most reliable man. He's his fucking driver, mate. 
Well, I don't, that's not how I see it. Well, that's not how you see it, but here I see it a different way. But when Bobby's on screen, you see, fuck all. He blocks the sun. So until next time, peace.